Are you on the search for your next Halloween costume? Are you tired of being a cat, devil, or coal miner every year? Well, look no further, because I have just the thing for you. A human-sized can of White Claw. First things first, though. So bubbly, but so delicious. No laws, baby. If you don't know me already, I'm Sarah and I like to make things specifically to wear on my body, specifically clothing. So that's why I'm going to DIY this costume from scratch. None of that painted on a t-shirt thing. We're gonna be a full-on 3D cylinder. A human-sized white claw. Yes, you heard it, and you better believe it. People also already seem to think that I am drunk most of the time, so I figured I really couldn't go wrong. <laughs> Let's get started. For this tutorial, you will need white cardboard, or cardboard, white poster board, paint brushes and paint, duct tape, and oh my god and a case or so of white claw. I don't want to admit this but it's really starting to hit me. Not really but kind of and I'm only like Two and a half in. <laughs> okay, so listen up. I have a plan. I do. <sighs> Everything's gonna be fine. Um, okay. I wanna make a full on cylinder and I thought that cardboard would be the best for that. So I found this, let me just say, I found all of this material except for the paint and duct tape at my local secondhand art supply thrift store called Indigo Hippo. You guys, <laughs> the best place on earth. Anyway, here's what I'm thinking. Hear me out. Hear me out. My thought was like, and this is the only option that I have at this point. I thought that I could like, kind of like bend this around my body. Okay, look. So it like, it like fits around me. And I thought that I could kind of like bend it like this type of thing and then it will become kind of cylindrical. What do you think? Do you think it could work? Help. <laughs> this trifle board is gonna be all bent up and not look very good. I'm gonna take the poster board, I'm gonna paint the logo on that, adhere it to my cylindrical, going to be cylindrical cardboard, and that's gonna be the outside and it's gonna look nice. But before I do that, I need to cut out some holes because I need to like, oh my God. I need to get this cardboard to like stay on my body. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna do like two straps and I'm gonna cut two holes in the sides, you know, below the armpits and then just two like two fabric straps that I'll sew together. Oh my God. I'm gonna have to operate a sewing machine right now. <laughs> I can do this, okay. First let's try and um, bend the board. Yeah. Tell me how you think it's going. I ripped it. That's okay. This is working out, I think. Oh, baby. So I've gotten it to like be pretty pliable. Okay, this looks like nothing at the moment. Okay, hold on. Also, side note. That's three. I'm not letting you down. Potty break. So I punctured holes um, through the armpits of the can and I'm gonna sew. I found an old t-shirt and I cut it up and I'm gonna sew. And now I'm gonna sew it together like this. 
So now I have to sew it while it's on the cardboard. So here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> Very dangerous, would not recommend. Success. I think it worked. This is me trying it for the first time ever. Alright, okay. Next step is to tape the crevasse. This is to tape this together. This is foolproof. Foolproof, so just hold the cardboard in between your legs like this. Mm-hmm. Yep. And then just take take away. Do your thing, girl. This is gonna be a while. It's gonna be worth it though. How am I thinking that I'm gonna use a whole roll of diamonds? I'm so stupid. Why don't you tell me that more often? Why don't you say, dude, you're so stupid. Tell you that all the time. <laughs> Potty break. because it looks like a very slim cylinder, which looks like a white claw can. I'm thinking that I'm just gonna take one of the posters and paint the logo onto it, which I don't know how it's gonna turn out at this moment in time, but um, first child but it is close look at this okay. you 
ready? comes down to I feel extremely proud of this for some reason maybe it's all the claws that I had to drink I don't know no laws baby <laughs> that is embarrassing anyway I am actually so proud of this costume <laughs> I think a great idea would be if you guys were to make like the whole case raspberry grapefruit whatever with your friends I don't know, just an idea. Tag me if you decide to do it. Please tag me if you try it because I will just, <laughs> I will cry if I see anyone else try this. There's no lie, um, this was a lot more fun than I thought it would be making this costume, especially drinking all of my white claws by myself, might I add. Side note, I know some of you are asking yourselves, how do I make this sexy? How do I make this a sexy white claw? You just don't wear anything underneath it. And you'll never know if I'm wearing anything underneath this. So have a, have a great Halloween and I hope to see you in my next video. Just like <gasps> lean back Damn. majorly. <gasps> painful <laughs> I know. in my armpits <laughs> oh my god